Yeah. How are you guys? You good? I'm uh, very depressed, everybody. I am. I just turned 20, and um, it's over. It's done. I just moved out of my mom's house, and I've realized something. I'm gonna fucking die. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not. I thought about it. I'm 6'3". I'm 140 pounds. I have a problem with wind. My friends are like, you want to go out? I'm like, you gotta check the forecast first. You might lose a friend. When I used to live with my mom, I just thought she was annoying. I thought she was annoying, and she cock blocked my masturbation time. That's all. I because she was the room next door, so every time I would get it going, I would like hear her sneeze and it would throw off my timing. And I'm like, I can't finish now. Mommy's sick. She might need these tissues. I miss living in my mom's house. When I used to live in my mom's house, I used to be able to jerk off in my bed, and then the next day, it would be gone. Now I live on my own. It just stays there. It's not going anywhere. It's not going anywhere until I move. I don't have the same fears I do now, though, jerking off by myself than when I live in my mom's house. Because I used to jerk off in my mom's bathroom, you know, because it smelled nice and there was lotion. And I just realized now I was jerking off to my mom's scent. So that's fucking weird. Anyway. Uh, just hit me. No, but it was I, my biggest fear, because I used to jerk off in her bathroom all the time, and sometimes I would finish on the toilet seat. And my biggest fear is that one day she would just sit on it and get pregnant. <laughs> Every day I would clean my bathroom. My mom had no idea what was going on. She was just like, you're such a good boy. <laughs> and I'm like, you have no idea what I'm trying to prevent right now. I had to move out. I had to move out of my mom's house. It got really weird. Uh, she bought me condoms. All right. And it's fine if you're a mom and you want to buy your son condoms. It's just a way to do it. You know, if you want to get your son condoms, just get them and leave them in his room. Don't tell him. He'll find them. That's the way to do it. That's not what my mom did. My mom did something really weird. Right? It was really weird. I was still staying at her house at the time, and it was like 11.30 at night, and she just barged in. She didn't text, knock, just barged in. And she was just like, hey, I got something for you. And I was high, so I was like, what the fuck? Is this? this is a little weird. And I swear to God, I turned on the lights. This is what she does. She has it, she had it behind her back and she pulls out a 40 pack. And I swear to God, this is what she does. She goes, I got every kind for my baby boy. <laughs> And then she winked at me, and I was like, you're giving the fucking weirdest vibe I've ever received in my life, Mom. I know you're single, I'm not the guy. I think it's time to move out, this is really weird. And she got me the 40 pack. I wanted to be like, who do you think your son is? <laughs> I didn't even get to use him. I just opened all of them and left them around their house. So she would find them and think I was cool. I did, she found one the other day, she called me. She was like, I found another condom. I'm like, yeah, you did, that's your boy. All right, guys, that's my time.